Very good afternoon and welcome to the brief at 30 here on TV1. For the news for Steam, I'm Rochelle Tumor. Let's start off with a look at your local news. United National Party General Secretary Palita Range Bandara says that the United National Party and the Sri Lanka Putujana Perumuna have decided to form an alliance to contest the upcoming local election. He said this decision was reached following a meeting between the two parties this afternoon and that they will contest under three methods. On to more local news, the Cabinet of Ministers once again granted permission to import eggs. Minister of Trade, Commerce and Food Security Nalin Fernando says the cabinet paper he submitted was approved yesterday. The Trade Minister says steps will be taken to import eggs from India before the end of this week. He added the private sector will be allowed to distribute the eggs. Eggs will also be sold through Lanka Satusa. Now on to your news overseas, tens of thousands of people in Brazil have held pro-democracy rallies in an angry response to the storming of the Congress of ex-president Jair Bolsonaro's supporters. In the country's largest city of Sao Paulo, crowds chanted that Bolsonaro must go to prison. About 1,500 people have been held over Sunday's riots in the capital, Brasilia. They came a week after President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva was sworn in after October's election that divided Brazil. On Monday evening, the new leader visited the damaged buildings of Congress, the Presidential Palace and Supreme Court together with the country's governors, condemning the terrorist acts and vowing to punish the perpetrators. Bolsonaro has not admitted defeat in the tightly fought election and flew to the U.S. before the handover on the 1st of January. He also condemned the attack and denied responsibility for encouraging the rioters in a post on Twitter some six hours after violence broke out. And finally, on to your sports news. Gareth Bale, former Wales Tottenham and Real Madrid, former retires from football aged 33. Bale has described the decision to quit international football as, quote, by far the hardest decision of his career, unquote. The Welshman won five Champions League titles and La Liga three times at Real Madrid and is considered one of Britain's greatest ever football exports. Wrap up your news for this hour. Thank you for watching.